Now, Dolly Cowan, Merry Christmas. Um, I had a request a while ago asking them to teach them the words to the Welsh lullaby, Siogan. Now, it's quite a long and complicated song with lots of lyrics. So, to begin with, as like a trial thing, I've decided to teach you a small four-line um, carol, I guess, um, that I learnt in primary school. Um, for those in America who do know what primary school is, it's, it's like I think it's like an elementary. You go there from when you're five years old up to eleven. And I, I learnt it at school. Um, it's very very simple. It's sort of Christmas based. Um, it does mention. I have to warn warn you really in case people get offended. It mentions um, Jesus Christ in it um, because it's his birthday, Christmas. Um, so if you're offended by that, I'm sorry. Um, you're probably best looking at another video. So anyways, this is my attempt at teaching you a song, and I'm going to see if it works. And if it does, I'll teach you more songs, if that's what you want. Um, again, comments and things are, are welcome. And if you want to sing along, once you've learnt it, go for it. Okay. Okay, to begin with, I'm going to sing the song all the way through. And then I'm going to sort of teach you bit by bit. So by the end of this video, hopefully, you'll be able to sing along with me. Okay? Right. <clears throat> okay, song is... Nadolig, Nadolig, sin oil vendi gedig, dan in et som da flip, en bluid jesse Christ. There we go. I have a cold, so I apologise for if you, any cats are going nuts at the moment and, and dogs are barking. So yeah, so that, that was it, it was only four lines. So let's take, I'll talk through it next. So let's take the line, these lines one by one. Okay, the first line, Nadolig, Nadolig. Nadolig is the Welsh word for Christmas. Um, it's, it's it, it, I think it's quite easy to remember English because it's it's sort of rhymes with holly and jolly and other things ending in ollie that have to do with Christmas. That was a little Hogfather reference there. I don't know if anybody will get that. Anyways, but yeah, so it sort of rhymes with holly. So if you get holly and you had Christmassy stuff, remember the G at the end though, right? It's Nadolig, not Nadolly. Because Nadolly would be no Dolly, no. And that's not good, right? So Nadolig. Okay, so you got that? Nadolig. Nadolig, okay? Or Nadolig, Nadolig. Okay? You got that? Next one, right. Okay, the next line has got quite a long word in it, but I'll talk you through it. Um, sin oil, which means is a holiday, because in Welsh we do things back to front, I think I've explained that before. Bendigedig. Yeah, I think you can look at what. Bendigedig is, is a play on words, it means blessed. But it also means sublime. So, it's you say what we're saying basically. Christmas is a blessed holiday because it's sort of rather religious. But for kids and stuff, we're getting presents, and all well, everybody else gets presents. It's sublime. It's fantastic. So, you can say you know that meal was bendy geddy. Ooh, it was lovely, delicious, right? It's a superlative basically. So anyway, let's go through his words again. Soon, that's quite yeah. S Y apostrophe N sin yeah, oil, oil, oil yeah, oil and Y and all oil. Right, the next one. A way you can pronounce this word actually is think of Mr. Geddig, who's very flexible. So he's bendy Geddig, bendy Geddig. Get it, bendy Geddig. It's an oil bendy Geddig. Yeah. What's in oil, bendy geddig? Yeah? Nice one. Okay. Right, the next line. Danin et on dathli. Again, you might think, what on earth is he saying? Right. Danin, yeah? Danin is a shortened vers or version of Rutani un, yeah? But for the purpose of the song, it's just Danin, yeah? And it means that we are, yeah? So. Or we we are, yeah we are. So Danine, yeah. Then Eto, yeah. You got that Eto? That's quite easy. 
Dathly might be a bit difficult. It's got the th in it, so it's so Dathly. Yeah, you got that. Danny Eton Dathly. Oh, there's an n at the end of Eto. Sorry, Danny Eton Dathly. Danny Eton Dathly. Yeah, Danny Eton Dathly. Got that? Okay. And the last line is Pembloid Yesigrist. See, long word, but Pembloid is a good one to remember because it means birthday. So, if you want to wish someone a happy birthday, it's a Pembloid Happis, yeah? Pembloid. So, start off with pen, the thing you write with, pen, yeah? And then bluid. Remember the double D thing at the end? Um, if you've forgotten how to pronounce that, go back to lesson one, um, where I go through the alphabet, and it's the, the, yeah? Pembloid, yeah? Pembloid. Yes, which is Jesus, yeah? So, so it's basically yes, e, or yes, e, yeah? Yes, e, okay? And greased, which is Christ. So remember to roll your R, so it's grr, yeah? It's not grr, it's not greased, it's greased, yeah? So Pembloid, Yesi, Christ, or Pembloid, Yesi, Christ, yeah, Pembloid, Yesi, Christ. So I'm going to sing through it again with the lyrics. The lyrics will be on screen, I think. Okay. So ready. Nadalig, Nadalig, sin oil vendi gedig, dani net on dafli, pembloid yesi greased. Now one thing you can try for fun, I'm going to sing through it three times, and you can it works like row, row, row your boat. There's probably a musical way of saying this, or uh, a term for it. But what basically, after I sing the first line, yeah, you come in when I start singing the second. So when I'm singing Nadolig Nadolig, you stay quiet. But when I say Sinoi Vendigedig, you sing Nadolig Nadolig, right? I'm going to sing through it three times. You can try it for fun because it's Christmas. Okay? <laughs> so ready? Okay. Nadolig Nadolig, Sinoi Vendigedig, Danny Nets on Dathlu, Pembloid Yesi Christ. Nadolig Nadolig, Sinoil Vendi Gedig, Danny Nets on Dathlu, Pembloid Yesi Christ. Nadolig Nadolig, Sinoi Vendi Gedig, Danny Nets on Dathlu, big finish. Pembloid Yesi Christ. So, if, I probably won't see you now until the new year so have a great new year uh, and a very merry christmas and happy new year so now dolly cowan i've loaded in there with that and i'll see you in 2010 we'll